India's Electric Highways 6,000 kilometers of electric vehicle-ready highways by year 2030 In a visionary and groundbreaking move, as per news reports of January 10, 2024, the Indian government is set to embark on a transformative journey with an ambitious plan to construct electric vehicle-ready highways covering a span of 6,000 kilometers on the Golden Quadrilateral, which is the country's largest national highway network. This visionary and transformative initiative, known as Vision 2030, PM Public Transport SUA, is poised to revolutionize India's transportation landscape by addressing and reducing fuel consumption and vehicular emissions through the widespread adoption of electric mobility. Hi friend! Welcome back to SciTech Buzz One channel. We wish to sincerely thank all the new subscribers of this channel. We have observed that 97% of our viewers haven't subscribed to our channel. If you haven't as yet subscribed, kindly consider doing so, after watching this video, since it would encourage us to do more. Watch this interesting video until the end so that you will not miss out on all the details. Historical Context To truly understand and appreciate the significance of this endeavor, it's essential to delve into the historical context of the Golden Quadrilateral Project. The Golden Quadrilateral, connecting major cities such as Delhi, Mumbai, Kolkata, and Chennai, has been a cornerstone of India's infrastructure since its inception. This extensive network, supplemented by additional corridors, plays a pivotal role in integrating industrial, agricultural, and cultural hubs across the nation. The Vision Unveiled the government's proposal involves the development of 6,000 kilometers of electric vehicle-ready highways over the next seven years. These highways, embedded with charging infrastructure and supply of electricity to moving vehicles through overhead power lines, all powered by green energy sources, are poised to create an ecosystem conducive to the proliferation of electric vehicles EVs, in India. The move aligns with the ambitious goal of replacing 800,000 aging and polluting diesel buses with electric buses by 2030, reflecting a steadfast commitment to cleaner, greener public transport. This includes 200,000 electric buses for state transport undertakings, 550,000 for private operators and 50,000 for schools and employee transportation. Electric Highways Defined Electric highways represent an energy-efficient solution, supplying electricity to moving vehicles through overhead power lines. This concept, globally recognized, has found success in Berlin, Germany, where the world's lengthiest e-highway spans 109 kilometers. In India, the Ministry of Road Transport and Highways plans to implement the electrification of highways through private companies under a Build, Operate, and Transfer BOT, model. An earlier video created on the topic of India's electric highways is available in this channel. For those interested to know about it in more detail, kindly access the link to the video through the I button at the top right hand corner of your video screen or through the video playlist available at the end of this video. Government's Vision and Stakeholder Engagement Nitin Gudkari, the Minister for Road Transport and Highways, expressed the government's interest in electric highways as early as September of the previous year or September 2023. Talks with stakeholders have been initiated, paving the way for discussions on replacing outdated diesel buses with their electric counterparts. The proposed model allocates 200,000 electric buses for state transport undertakings, 550,000 for private operators, and an additional 50,000 for school and employee transportation. Challenges and Opportunities Despite the ambitious vision, the sales of electric cars in the previous year fell short of the targeted 100,000 units, reaching only 83,000. Consumer concerns, such as limited range and inadequate charging infrastructure, have hindered the widespread adoption of electric vehicles as the primary mode of personal transport. However, the construction of e-highways is anticipated to address these concerns by catalyzing the development of charging infrastructure, making electric cars a more viable and attractive option for daily commutes. Impact on Socioeconomic Landscape The electrification of highways is poised to bring about a transformative impact on various facets of India's socioeconomic landscape. Let's delve into the potential impacts on employment, trade, commerce, and overall regional development. 
1. Employment opportunities. The deployment of electric buses and the construction of e-highways will generate a plethora of employment opportunities. From manufacturing electric vehicles and charging infrastructure to maintenance and operations, the entire value chain will see a surge in demand for skilled and unskilled labor. The skills required for these jobs will span various domains, including technology, engineering, and renewable energy, contributing to the upskilling of the Indian workforce. 2. Trade and Commerce as the Golden Quadrilateral serves as a critical link between major cities and industrial hubs, the electrification of highways is expected to streamline logistics, reducing costs and enhancing efficiency. This could lead to a substantial boost in trade and commerce, fostering economic growth across connected regions. The ripple effect on ancillary industries such as packaging, warehousing, and distribution could further amplify the positive economic impact. Three. Regional development, regions along the Golden Quadrilateral and its additional corridors are likely to witness accelerated development. Improved connectivity, coupled with reduced emissions, can attract investment, leading to the establishment of new industries and the expansion of existing ones. The development of smart cities along these corridors, equipped with modern infrastructure and sustainable practices, could redefine the socio-economic landscape of these regions. Four. Environmental impact, the shift to electric mobility is a crucial step towards achieving environmental sustainability. By curbing vehicular emissions along the Golden Quadrilateral, the initiative aligns with global climate goals, contributing to India's commitment under COP28 guidelines. The positive environmental impact extends beyond reduced air pollution to include conservation of natural resources and a decrease in dependence on fossil fuels, promoting a greener and healthier environment. Infrastructure Development The construction of electric vehicle-ready highways necessitates a robust charging infrastructure to support the envisioned proliferation of electric buses and cars. The government's commitment to a build, operate, and transfer, BOT, model involving private companies highlights a collaborative approach to infrastructure development. The integration of green energy sources for charging infrastructure aligns with global efforts to transition toward sustainable energy solutions. 1. Charging infrastructure challenges. While the government's vision is commendable, challenges related to charging infrastructure must be addressed. The availability and accessibility of charging stations in urban, suburban, and remote areas are critical for the success of electric mobility. The government's commitment to ensuring quick charging facilities, multiple payment options, and additional amenities such as dining spaces and clean toilets demonstrates an understanding of the importance of user experience in promoting electric vehicle adoption. 2. Public-Private Partnerships PPP The involvement of private companies in the electrification of highways through a PPP model signifies a strategic collaboration. It not only leverages the efficiency and innovation capabilities of the private sector but also distributes the financial burden of infrastructure development. This approach aligns with global best practices in infrastructure projects, where successful PPPs have demonstrated the ability to expedite project timelines and enhance overall project quality. 3. Integration with existing highways Converting existing highways into electric highways is a pragmatic approach to maximize the impact of electrification efforts. Identifying and transforming established routes into e-highways, along with the establishment of sufficient charging stations, facilitates cost-effective green intercity public transportation. The National Highways Authority of India's NHAI, potential implementation of an electric tariff system, akin to tolls on highways, provides a sustainable funding mechanism for the maintenance and expansion of the electric highway network. Consumer Adoption and Awareness The success of the electrification initiative hinges on widespread consumer adoption of electric vehicles. Addressing consumer concerns and fostering awareness are pivotal components of the strategy to make electric mobility a mainstream choice. 1. Consumer Concerns the shortfall in electric car sales in the previous year underscores prevalent consumer concerns. Limited range and inadequate charging infrastructure have dissuaded first-time buyers from considering electric vehicles as their primary mode of transport. The construction of e-highways, 
coupled with the proliferation of charging infrastructure, is poised to alleviate these concerns by offering a reliable and convenient charging network. 2. Government Incentives The government's commitment to offering electricity at subsidized rates and potentially implementing an electric tariff system underscores a supportive regulatory environment. Financial incentives and policy frameworks that encourage the adoption of electric vehicles can play a crucial role in overcoming initial resistance and promoting a shift toward sustainable transportation options. 3. Public Awareness Campaigns A comprehensive public awareness campaign is imperative to dispel myths, educate consumers, and create a positive perception of electric mobility. Highlighting the environmental benefits, cost savings in the long run, and the evolving technological landscape of electric vehicles can contribute to a paradigm shift in consumer attitudes. Global Benchmarking Benchmarking against global initiatives in electric mobility and electrification of highways provides valuable insights for refining strategies and addressing potential challenges. 1. Berlin, Germany's e-highway success, the world's lengthiest e-highway in Berlin, Germany, covering 109 kilometers, serves as a successful benchmark. Analyzing the factors that contributed to its success, such as comprehensive charging infrastructure and seamless integration with existing transportation networks, can inform the Indian initiative and ensure a smoother implementation. 2. International Collaboration Exploring opportunities for international collaboration and knowledge exchange can enhance the effectiveness of India's electrification efforts. Engaging with countries at the forefront of electric mobility, such as Norway and the Netherlands, can provide valuable insights into best practices, regulatory frameworks, and technological advancements. Conclusion In conclusion, the government's plan to construct electric vehicle-ready highways on the Golden Quadrilateral is a transformative step towards a sustainable and greener future. The integration of electric buses, charging infrastructure, and the electrification of highways is not just a technological evolution but a holistic approach to reshape India's transportation landscape. The socio-economic impacts, ranging from employment generation to enhanced trade and regional development, underscore the profound implications of this visionary initiative. As India strides towards becoming a leader in electric mobility, the electrification of highways stands as a testament to the nation's commitment to a cleaner and more sustainable tomorrow. The challenges ahead, including charging infrastructure development, consumer adoption, and global benchmarking, necessitate a collaborative and strategic approach. With comprehensive planning, effective execution, and continuous refinement based on global best practices, India's electrification journey has the potential to set new benchmarks in sustainable transportation. Stay tuned for further developments on this project. Do let us know your thoughts on the subject in the comments section. My friend, if you have found any value in this video, then kindly click on like button as an encouragement to create better quality content. Please share this video amongst your family members, friends, and in your social media network so that this information might benefit others. Don't forget to subscribe to SciTech Buzz One channel so that you will not miss out on any of our forthcoming videos. Thank you.